What's up my YouTube family? This is your boy so stylistic. Listen, first of all, I just have to say thank you guys so much for the love and support that you guys have been showing. I've been doing a lot of videos lately live um, and I haven't really been recording and um, editing and posting my videos. I've been more so going on live on YouTube. And those of you that have been coming in while I've been on live and commenting, and um, just supporting and showing love. I appreciate you guys so much for everything. I really do. Um, you guys really do make me better, make me want to be better. Thank you so much for the encouragement. I really appreciate it all. So just to tell you guys a little bit about what's going on in this video, in case you didn't catch it earlier this week, I actually uh, went live on this video. But of course, you know, YouTube has their copyright claims. So music was playing in the background. And of course, I didn't want to take the video down from live. So I left it up, but I decided that I would edit the video so you guys can see how I naturally um, press out um, and do my silk wraps. So I decided to go ahead and edit this. Um, so I was live on my iPad and I was recording from my iPhone. Technology is amazing. So in this video, you're gonna actually see me doing my silk press and silk wrap method. And I wanted to show you guys on Lauren because Lauren has very uh, thick hair. Um, it's high in density. Um, her curl pattern is more so wavy than it is uh, curly. Um, it's, she really has very beautiful hair and it presses out very, very nicely. Um, but So I want her to be my model for this video and I really just wanted to go live with Lauren that day. <laughs> but anyway, um, so what you're gonna see is um, me subsectioning um, my, sub my sections, my subsections. Um, you're also just going to see how I pass down the hair shaft when I'm pressing out, um, showing you how I chase, um, I call it the chase method, it's saved my life, um, being able to just press through the hair one time and not going over the hair multiple times and just evenly um, distributing the heat through the hair uh, so you don't have to keep going over the hair several times. I know I've seen it so many times and still see it to this day, and I get on my students about it. I just by passing over the hair so many times and don't realize how you can really um, jeopardize the integrity of the hair by doing so because you're still dealing with heat. Um, so you're just gonna see me here in this video doing what I love. One of the things that I love to do best and that's silk wrap and silk press hair. Also, just to let y'all know, uh, cause I know a lot of people ask, what kind of iron do I use? Um, I used to be a FHI guy. I used to pride myself on FHI flat irons. Um, and I still have some to this day that I still use, but I have, grown to fall in love with h2 pro if you guys can get your hand on any of their flat irons i promise you you will love them um so i'm starting to build my collection with them so in this particular video i'm using my h2 pro um, black onyx iron it's made out of tourmaline um and i just love simply love this iron it does exactly what i need what i needed to do every time um so that's the flat iron that I'm using in this particular video. Now you're gonna see me use a smaller flat iron when I go around Lauren's edges, and that's the EAP heat. Um, again, that's EAP heat, um, and I also lo I love that flat iron as well. Um, it's actually one; it's a favorite of mine as well. But um, so those are the two flat irons that you're gonna see me use in this particular video. Um, now, in my other videos, I think. I try to tell y'all majority of the time what I'm using um, when I'm flat iron because I, I'm just a flat iron freak. But I found a line that I love and I just absolutely want to grow my flat iron collection with this line. And that's the way I used to do it, FHI. Um, but anyway, so that's the heating tool that I'm using to actually do this service. 
Okay, so far as far as product is concerned, um, Lauren was um, shampooed with Naked by Asians, and it's a line that I have grown to love, and I am learning to use and love it more and more each day. It has great moisture in it. It has all of the things that we need in our hair as ethnic people. Um, to keep our hair healthy, shiny, um, to give it that protein, to give it um, that nice finished look. So um, everything that I used in this uh, particular video on this day on Miss Lauren was by Essations. Um, and they have a line inside of Essations called Naked. So Naked by Essations is pretty much what it is. And so I used the whole entire not the entire line guys but you know i used the collection on her um naked biasations um actually what i did with lauren when she came in i detoxed her um they have a shampoo that's called the detox which is pretty much clarifying shampoo um she had told me that she had been sweating um the previous week before because she went to a dance camp and they danced for three days straight for like 12 hours um each day and so she had told me she had done a lot of sweating um and she went out to la um so i made sure that i wanted to detox her hair get rid of all that salt um and all of the oils that had been built up and then i went in behind that and i also did um, moisture repair which is so great it's a detangling shampoo um it's called moisture repair and it is when i tell you it's the bomb like it really feels like silk when you're shampooing the hair um it's great to put the moisture back into the hair because i just believe that when you go and strip the hair you need to go back and replenish the hair from what you've taken away from it so i went in and i did the moisture repair shampoo on her and then we have this special um cocktail that we use that my friend um sam washington if you guys find him on youtube um if you just look up uh, silk press king um, you'll find a guy by the name of Sam Washington that came up with a silk press method and just the way that he does his silk press method I took some of his stuff and put it with mine and it works out perfect but um, so cocktails excuse me this conditioner together uh, which I love doing I'm a cocktail king and um, we just take all of the conditioners in the uh, e Sations line and mix them together um, add a little bit of uh, the silkening glaze oil to it um, as well as some of the um, hair mender just a little bit um, and then give them a good steam treatment um, this makes sure that they get all of the conditioning that they need in the hair um, build up the protein in the hair the keratin all of that good stuff. Everything that you need that you could possibly think of is being taken care of when you do this cocktail. And this is such a great service to upsell to your clients when they come in. Really deep conditioning treatment. Um, I steam my... 95% of my clients, they get steam treated. But to do this uh, cocktail to this method, because you have to have all of the conditioners to do it, um, is really another upsell upsell so you know usually when i steam my clients i mean of course it's going to be a deep conditioner but i usually use maybe one conditioner or i do the seven and one uh, which is seven conditioners in one but when you do the cocktail it's like oh my god you got the seven in one you have the sanity it's just like seven more conditioners added so you, you got 14 to 15 conditioners in one um cocktail um and you're putting this back into the hair you're just building up that hair and it just gives it that shine and um, that vibrancy that you know we look for that body that bounce it doesn't weigh the hair down um so it's a great thing to do and um, a great upsell in the salon when you do it if you're doing a lot of silk presses um not just that but i also do it on my clients that are relaxed um because i do have clients that are relaxed um, so I do it on them as well because, of course, when you go in and you do relaxers, you're bre breaking down bonds in the hair. So you want to help build those bonds back up and keep them strong. Um, so I do it on them as well because I give them silk wraps as well. And people say, well, how do you do that with a relaxer? Pretty much just wrapping the hair in saran wrap, silk wrapping it. So roller set it, wrap it, you know, 
and make sure that the hair is light and fluffy and it gives it that shine, you know, just without the heat. So, but it's a great upsell. Um, but this is just what I did in this video. And you guys, I know I'm talking in this video a lot. And that's because some music ran out. And I'm editing from my phone. And I didn't know how to put the rest of the music on here to play. And I don't really talk to y'all that often anymore. So <laughs> that's why I'm talking a lot. But if there's anything you guys um, need to know, want to know, um, that I didn't say in this video, or any product that you wanted to know that I used, um, uh, the specifics of it, just hit me up. Uh, put it in the comment um, box below. Uh, make sure that you like, subscribe, and share this video. Also, you guys, go follow me on Instagram. Um, my Instagram name is so underscore stylistic underscore hair. Um, you can also follow me on Facebook. Um, just put in so stylistic. And you guys, if there's anything that you want to know, just ask me. I'm one of those stylists. I love to share with other stylists. I love to educate clients because I want them to be educated when they go to their stylists. I want um, other stylists to become educated as well. And I try to make sure that I educate myself as well. You know, the more you know, the more you grow. And that's just what I believe. But thank y'all so much for watching this video and listening to me talk. Um... <laughs> this late at night and i hope you enjoy the rest of the video and big shout out to miss lauren lee for being my model for this video uh and i'll talk to you guys again soon and look out for more videos because i'm gonna be posting a whole lot more yes i am because you guys are just making my day and i love you so much peace out